Talked about the mood of his team and how everyone has handled the news of Ignite not coming back after the season as Kenneth Lofton Jr. gets the scoring started. Good job by Almanza pushing Kenneth Lofton away from the paint. Trying to go to work with five seconds inside. He gets in close and finishes. And, you know, the people that are in the midst of it don't really know how to handle the change. A, a great seal that time by Lofton. I mean, he, he, they're going to have to find out how to take his angles away and to develop guys so that they would be NBA ready. Here's Lofton on the block. Will Davis now into the game. And Lofton, another easy close two. Lofton in close, he's got 10. That competitiveness we talked about from Buzelic, that heart, that toughness. The G League and to, you know, four lottery picks in, in three years, 10 draft picks. Um, just, you know, I, I, a lot to be really, really proud of. And him being here with us with Ignite and helping these young men and, you know, a lot of going through a lot of growing pains where the main thing isn't always making sure that, you know, you, you end the game. Um, experimental rules committee with you know different stakeholders around our league to look at what should we be doing um, next what should be the next rules that we experiment with they're just continue to get better and more and more comfortable him dink um, you know I was talking to dink yesterday he was telling me how much more comfortable he's getting um, in the game got John, I have to, I have to say too. I, I mean, Amanza, I tell you what, he's going to be a really talented pro player. He's played, I think, out of position this whole year because, I mean, and but picking the guys that have been raised right and then fostering them in this atmosphere, it, that's I think has been the biggest. Oh. <laughs> Lofton, you talk about clearing space off, that may not be an option. Well, because you have to work really hard to be successful. And so there's a level of respect for people have for guys that have worked hard. Wojo has worked extremely hard. Not only did he start, she said she's got a picture of him in his house. I mean, so, but that's the heart that's, that, that Wojo. Here's York, step back, a little heat check. <laughs> Lofton through the paint, takes the bump, plus the foul. Watch this. Nobody even attempts to step in front to take the charge. Inside, Lofton Jr. gets the scoring started here in the fourth. You also have Ethan Almanza, who is thought of very highly, and Tyler Smith right now, who's out with an injury. He's a professional bucket getter, as Lofton now with 42. As a reminder, Salt Lake City will be back here in this building tomorrow night. Back-to-back -back games as Kenneth Lofton Jr., 44 points. Well, this has been the game plan tonight. Get it to Kenneth Lofton and let him go to work. Sané <laughs> he just makes a business him. decision. <laughs> and that's messed with Sané a couple times down here on the floor coming offensively. There goes Lofton Jr., 48 points tonight. I would really double him. I would make somebody else beat me. There goes Lofton against Buzelis. He just threw Buzelis. At some point, you have to call an offensive foul. You got to go get Lofton right now. You got to go get him. Lofton doubling, puts it in. He's got 52 points tonight. 